Hello, everybody. Today we will talk about the Misra Greece algorithm. Um, if you want to download the sheet, by the way, that I'm writing, you can find it at the description under the video. And um, the Misra Greece algorithm, we will discuss it uh, with the help of an example. So we have a data stream. And um, for example, it's uh, two nine nine seven nine nine. So, and um, for this stream, we know m is equal m is the number of the total, um, of, like of the total different numbers in the stream. So m is one, two, three, four, five, six in this case. And the uh, Misra Gris algorithm uh, c uh, will answer the question so the, qu the question is um, is there a number in the data stream um, that occurs more often than um, um, m divided by 2. So in this case, is there any number in this data stream that uh, appears more than 3 times? So we already see, okay, there's a 9 here that appears 4 times, which is bigger than 3. So the output of this algorithm should be uh, yes, there is a number, and the number is 9. So what the algorithm does is, uh, well, the data stream, like you, you read each number at once, you don't read them all at the same time, you read one after the other. And um, so we keep, um, we keep an ID um, and a count. And um, so we read the first uh, number of the stream, which is 2. And the ID will be 2, and the count will be 1. That's the initial. initial initially, uh, the count is 0, but like if you read the first number, this is what happens. And then the next number that you read is 9. Um, the ID stays 2, but um, the count um, increments, de decrements, I mean, like, yeah, minus 1, um, minus 1, because there is, uh, because there is a different number that appeared. And then you read the next number um, of the stream. And what happens is the ID changes now, it becomes 9, because the ID changes when the count is 0 at the, um, like the, the time before. And um, yes, it's, it um, becomes 1. 9 gets the 1. And um, the next number is uh, 7. The ID stays seven, uh, stays nine, because it always it only changes when there is a zero. Um, so the count is zero because there is a different number that came. And um, now the next number in the stream is a nine, and the ID is already nine, so the count is um, is allowed to. Um, Increment, and then the last number is again a nine, and um, the idea is already nine. It stays nine, and the count gets two. So the output. Uh, so that's the end, and the output is um, nine. So yes, there is a number. Um, 
that appears more often than m divided by 2 uh, and it's it's the number 9 and um, if the count is 0 at the end um, what the out the output of the algorithm is um, none. So, like, is like there is no number that appears uh, uh, more often than n divided by two. So this is only an example for the algorithm. There is a more general way to uh, like in this case we have specified. The, this number here, but we can also uh, have a more general case, so m divided by k plus 1, and there will be also a video uh, about that, but this is for the introduction uh, to the Grease algorithm. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and take care, and bye-bye. So, I still wanted to um, tell you why this works in this case by uh, with the n divided by 2. Um, so the counter will be um, will be incremented so much by the by the number that appears uh, more than m divided by 2 that it that the count cannot be 0 at the end and the ID cannot be a different number because there are not enough other numbers to uh, decrement the count as much because uh, the number just appears in the stream uh, more than a half and yeah that's why it's work it's that simple but I forgot to say it and I wanted to you to know it okay thanks